The, the idea that, that science is, is, is a religion, um, when in fact science is interested in evidence and, will, and is prepared to change its mind if contrary evidence comes in, that's very, very different from a, re a religion. As Lawrence said earlier, in science we constantly open to the possibility of having to change our minds and science proceeds by progressive refinement and changing minds and there, there, there are things that I suppose will never be disproved, things like um, that the planets orbit the sun, that's never going to change. Um, I don't think that the fact of evolution is ever going to be disproved, it's, it's always going to, be, going to be true that we are cousins of chimpanzees and of monkeys and of kangaroos. Um, so there are certain things that we, that we definitely know to be true. The evidence is so overwhelming that to, in Stephen Gould's words, to object would be perverse. Um, but so-called religious truths have absolutely no evidence going for them whatsoever. If I challenged you as Richard Dawkins, you'd probably have a problem with that. Doesn't matter who I am. No. No, we're, we're listening to you now. Like, you know, you're you're challenging me now, and I'm, and, and I'm accepting the challenge. <laughs> and, well, and... Fair enough. Look, I'm a Catholic. I don't agree with what George Pell thinks, but I don't think he's a pedophile either. Like... No, I don't suppose he is. But, um... well, just, you know... I, I, I don't know. I've never asked him. My point is that you, as an eminent scientist, if I challenge your scientific doctrine, maybe your theories or your opinion, you'll, you'll disagree with me. Well, I, I, I will, I mean, when you say disagree, I, I will say, where is your evidence? Here's my counter evidence. And I'll let's, yours. let's sit down together and look at the evidence. I mean, it, that's very different from saying that, that I'm arguing from authority. In fact, let me jump in. Authority, that's the key point. Richard is not an authority. I'm not an authority. There are no scientific authorities. That's a key point. There are scientific experts. Richard knows a lot about zoology. I know a lot about physics. But there's no one whose views are not subject to question. 